K Sports as we get set to bring you an exciting NBA basketball game. This is Kevin Harlan. I'm joined by Richard Jefferson and Greg Anthony. And David Aldridge will be reporting from the sideline. It's the Chicago Bulls and the Portland Trailblazers. And it's going to be the Trailblazers off the tip. Now let's take a look at the Bulls opening lineup. They've got Harper. Pippen is out there with Dennis Rodman. Then it's Jordan. And it's Longley in at the five. Now here's Hart. Six to shoot. Cross contact on the shot. And now a three-point play chance as he'll head to the line. I tell you what, it's it's almost like he's stealing to watch how he plays the game from this scene. And he's got his first, first chance foul. at the line here. First team foul. At the line for the Trailblazers, Josh Hart. At the line for one. Find the lane. Find the lane. One shot. Here's Jordan. Right side Harper. Pass to Rodman. Dishes it to Jordan. From 18 feet away. Net drops and it comes off the assist from Rodman. Yeah, when we think about the excitement that Jordan brings to the game, but, but what about the offensive fundamentals? The, the, the man is a perfectionist. Here's Jerome. Grant gets a wide open look. Here's Hart. Rebound by Pippen. And so it's Pippen with it. He brings it up for the Bulls. A nice shot by Jordan. Yeah, high percentage look for Jordan. It has every move you could ask for in the painted area. And that was the mobile one drive. Well worth a second look. And you've got to love the aggression that he had taking it to the rim there. Sets the tone in a close game like this one. Takes it inside. Hart, wide open. He fires. Hands it from downtown. Hart. Hart's got six points. And they don't want to get in a habit of giving him open looks from three. First quarter still, but not who you want to leave open. Now here's Jordan. Outside Harper. Lock at six. Shoots over Grant. Here's Rodman. Good for the basket. Dennis Starting Rodman. off one for one with that shot. Woo. Right now they are humming along. Three or four to start this game. Now the pass to Sharp. Hart with it. He has six. Left side Grant. Over Rodman. That one wide left. So for the Trailblazers, their last game, a loss to the Utah Jazz. Well, they made a few key shots, but missed many more. It was a rough night for them offensively. And tonight, I expect them to play better offensively, try to get some closer looks. Now, here's Sharp, following the miss by Michael Jordan. And all oh, the talent oh, in the world. That's what made Sharp the first, seventh first overall first pick. Foul in a fairly second deep draft. Portland shooting their second and third free throws That's tonight. And, and how about as a group? 80% on the season. One of their best attributes. Shooting two. And he knocks down the first one. And he makes both free throws. Chicago trailing here. Pippen the pass to Rodman. Jordan looking around. Watch the 
There's the drive. And it's Jordan with the jam. Yeah, just forcing the issue offensively. The, the great thing about Jordan, he does it while staying under control. Back to Hart. Here's Sharp. Grant trying to break free. Portland no good that time either. To the inside. Swiped it away. Now, here's Sharp. Defended by Jordan. Sharp, the pass to Grant. Rebound by the Bulls. You often expect him to convert these types of shots, but the D must have made their presence felt to prevent that one. First personal foul. First team foul. The Bulls shooting, shooting their Chicago. initial free throws of the game right Scotty here. Pippen. Two shots. They now lead as the free throw drops for him. And maximum effort. That's what you see from Scottie Pippen game after game. He looks for ways to affect the game every minute. And both free throws good for Pippen. Here's Hart. He's got six. Pass to Sharp. Here's Eubanks. Pass to Jerome. Knocked loose. Harper with the steal. Oh, and a fast break for the Bulls. Stops. Hops. Chicago with a new 14. He gets it in there. Dennis That's Rodman. a blue-collar bucket right there. Grown man basket. Put in the work. Got a second chance to score. And the first time out of the game called here for the Trailblazers. You know, trying to stem the tide here. On the wrong side of a scoring run here, we might see a lineup change. I'll, I'll be pretty curious. That was awesome. Fans, join me in thanking your Blazer dancers. Grant, he's still scoreless so far in this one. Passes to Jerome. Poke loose. Here's Sharp. Can't hit that one. Jordan with some nice D. Chicago leading by four. Whistle blows. Basket is good. So a chance here for a three-point play. Second personal And their offense already in a flow. Some stellar shooting to jump out to this league. Scotty Pippen. And let's quickly check out the scoring breakdown here for the Bulls. The Trailblazers making a switch here. Little's checked in. Free throw good from Pippen. And the Trailblazers with possession here. They trail by seven. The pass to Sharp. 
And here is Grant, defended by Rodman. Pass to Jerome. Finds himself wide open and drills it. And the lack of effort to fight over the screen there makes that an easy shot. Yeah, as soon as these guys feel contact, they are just disappearing like they're not even there. You got to show some fire and keep defending. Now, here's Rodman. Long way down low, and the layup's good off the glass. Yeah, they're going to have a nice little run here. Trailblazers trail by seven. Pass to Sharp. Here's Eubanks, covered by Long. With the fadeaway. It's all in by the Bulls. Pippen's got his fourth rebound in this one. Here's Harper. And he makes the bucket, gets the whistle, and now a three-point play chance here for him. Personal foul. And boy, are they attacking the paint. And this is his first trip to the line tonight. Ron Harper, one shot. And Harper no good on that one. And here are the Trailblazers. Nine-point game. Now, here's Sharp. Down to five on the shot clock. Some solid defense from Pippen. And he's very confident from that range. But you can't make him off. And there it is for Scottie him. Pippen. And that's now Assisted seven points here for Scotty Pippen. Harper. Defensively giving up far too many open rhythm looks. Here's Little. A three-pointer is right on target. Nice vision from the youngster. Sharp that time. Pippen kicks to Rodman. Passes it to Hart. To the paint. Wants to get it to Jordan, and does. Over Sharp. No good from Jordan. How did he break that one? He smoked it. Everything was set up for that to be an easy basket. And the pass to Sharp. Up and in, it's good. First basket of the game for him. One for four shooting. Oh, gritty play by Sharp inside. Defense puts contact on the rookie, and he still gets it to fall. And some nice ball movement here by Chicago. Longley can't get it to go. And that one gives them a plus five rebound advantage, Kevin. Here's Jerome. Defended by Rodman. Jerome, good. Great job of screening there. Nice job to take it to the rim and get the finish. And the first time out of the game called for Chicago. Let them hear from you. Make some noise for your Blazers answer. Godford's checked in, and it's Justin, Justin Winslow in, in for Grant. Then for the Bulls, Tony Kukoc, he's checked in for Long. Kerr comes in for Jordan, and it's Brown in for Harper. 
Now, here's Pippen. He's got seven. And there's a pattern starting to take shape here. They're working it inside and getting good shots from close range. Here's Jerome. He's covered by Brown. Jerome passes to Winslow. Johnson kicks to Little. From deep. No good on the shot. And Chicago will go the other way with it. Well, you, you have to like their work on the boards, Kevin. Particularly here mm -hmm. to start the game. This shows how confident Kerr is. Knows how dangerous he can be off the catch. Here's Jerome. And the call will be against Scotty Pippen. That'll be his second foul of the game. Bushler's checked in for Rodman. Coming out of the floor for the Bulls, Judd Bushler. Now, Little. And again, it's the Trail Blazers missing. Chicago leading by eight. Here's Kukoc, and it's Kukoc with the jam. Assist from and they have owned the paint Scotty so Pepper. far, and the score reflects it. It also allows them to play inside out, which will make them even more difficult to defend. Here's Jerome. Little passes to Johnson. There's Winslow. And he drops it in from the low post. He saw a path to the rim, and he took it. The defense just couldn't stop him. Brown kicks to Kukoc. Brown outside. Six on the shot clock. And the call on the shot that sends him to the line. First. Personal. Tenacious move by Brown. Fourth Going up for a shot strong and then playing through the contact. The First trip to the free throw line Randy for him in this Brown. one. Taking two shots. Two shots. And he makes the first. High effort play. That's what you get from Randy Brown. A guy who tries to do a lot for his team and always puts in the work. Brown, he's checked in for Portland. Rodman, he's checked in for Chicago. And Brown drops them both. Trailblazers trailed by 10. Kicks to Brown. Winslow against Kukoc. And the shot is long. Here's Bushler. Nothing yet on the scoreboard for him. They've been looking out of sync offensively. Yeah, that, their offense has ground to a standstill. The basket counts and one. He'll go to the line with a chance to make it a three-point play. A quality pass setting up a quality first, shot. It's just no textbook foul. basketball. First trip to the free throw line for him tonight. The and they have really leaned on his free throw Deion shooting Johnson. at times this season. He's been there for them, too, with 88% from the line. And that one falls for Johnson. Chicago leading by seven. Brown the pass to Kukos. He kicks it to Kirk. Bulls moving the ball around. Brown. Beautiful Randy dish and the layup Brown. goes down. I mean the number of points they've scored in the paint already here is eye open. Brown outside. Out up there for Johnson. And it's out of bounds. Out of bounds. They say it was last touch by Brown. No clue where that pass was going. That is a brutal turnover. 158 left to play in the first. Round kicks to Kukoc. Oh. 
And that'll be two free throws coming up. Officials on the call with the foul. And you want to talk about difficult guys to match up with. Tony Kukoc at 6'11 can shoot it, handle it. I mean, how do you guard it? At the line for two. First free throw is good. And the Croatian swingman Kukoc, a valuable, multifaceted player who can do a little bit of everything. Off on that one, so he goes one for two at the line. You, you just have to be more disciplined. I mean, too many fouls and free throw attempts for the opponent. Johnson surveying the floor. There's Winslow. Johnson at the elbow. Four on the clock. And the officials call him for a three-second violation. Chicago ball. It's Rodman with the ball for the Bulls. Ten-point lead. Pass to Kerr. The kick out to Brown. Just five to shoot. Score the basket. His second of two attempts. I like their focus coming in. Terrific execution so far. Couldn't come up with a much better start than this. They just have to keep it going. Now, here's Johnson. There's Winslow. And he gets the whistle. Two free throws coming up. That one on Kukoc. Nice work to get it inside and draw the contact. The Trailblazers have looked good at the line. Today. They're perfect in four attempts. Winslow. At the line for two. Shooting two. And that one misses. And he's good on the second. Chicago leading by 11. Brown kicks to Kukoc. Pass to Kerr. And here is Brown. He's got six. Back to Kerr from downtown. The shot, no good. And it's Portland the other way. The shot and game clock separated by four. Johnson finds Winslow. Here's Watford inside. Here's Jerome. It's hauled in by Brown. To the middle. Here's Kukoc. Plays it up and banks it in. Kukoc has got five. Their play on both ends has been superb. We, we'll see if they can maintain the momentum. They came out and bum-rushed them. Huge difference in activity level from both teams tonight. And so in Chicago. 13 points up at the end of the period. They've excelled in the open court. Their transition game has allowed them to build this healthy lead. Back right after this. So far through one quarter, it's been a lopsided game. We'll see if that changes here in the second. And a comfortable margin here, guys, for the Bulls. 
you, you got to credit their defense. Communicating, rotating, making plays on the ball. It's been a group effort, and that's what it takes to play the kind of defense that they've played. Great showing from them. Chicago leading by 13. Now Sharp out there with Sharp. Then there's Jeremy Grant. Then it's Little. And it's Eubanks in at the five. They're the group the Portland Trailblazers will start the second quarter with. Scotty and he comes up with the deuce. Those defenders just look a little bit gassed. I mean, they're getting pushed around on that low block. Hart the pass to Sharp. Back to Hart. Passes it to Little. Now, here's Sharp. Floats one up. That one, no good. Good D by Jordan. Outside, Kukoc. Here's Brown. That one misses. Now the Trailblazers take it the other way. Now the pass to Little. To the inside. And he could not get that one to go. Out of contact, and he'll go to the line for two. Personal foul. Portland, they have shot five of six at the foul line tonight. At the line for Portland, Drew Eubanks taking two shots. Shooting two. He misses the free throw. Second free throw, no good. Normally he sinks all of his free throws. The defense got lucky there. Jordan with the Michael bucket. Jordan. How many times have we seen a possession like that from them today? Ending with a basket, coming off a pretty pass. Sharp, the pass to Hart. Got a piece of it. And here's the fast break. Jordan leading the way. Just about a minute and a half has gone by here in the second. Trailblazers trailed by 18. Pass to Sharp. Shoots over Brown. And that one hits back iron. They're losing because he is struggling so bad, and he has not looked comfortable all game. Who coach kicks to Brown. He feeds it to Pippen. And Pippen Got slams it, it in. Don't you That's wish so you could good. leap like Randy Pippen? Brown. I mean, I do. Pass to Little. Here's Eubanks. Portland no good that time either. The Bulls leading by 20. Kukoc dishes to Pippen. Passes it to Jordan. Pippen down low. He's covered by Grant. And he gets Scotty it to go. Pippen. Pippen's got 13. This is a big time game for Scotty offensively thus far. He's setting a high bar for the rest of the guys on that end. Time called here. The Blazers decide to talk it over. Well, it's been an express lane to the rim. Coach can't be happy about that. Yeah, we can see over here. The coach, he has some choice words for his team. Words we cannot repeat. Fans, let them hear from you. Make some noise for your Blazer dancers. to get loud for your Blazer Dancers. It's dance time. 
time in Portland. Here are your Blazer dancers. And the Bulls making a change here. Harper's checked in. We're just over two and a half minutes into the second quarter. Little passes to Sharp. And it's going to be out of bounds. The Trailblazers will retain possession. Remains Portland ball. The pass to Hart. Five to shoot. Who coach against Grant? And guys, it really looks like they've lost a step here in the second quarter. They, they have been really stagnant offensively. Back to Jordan. Over Hart. And there's Jordan. That's good on the assist by Kukoc. And 11 points for Michael Jordan. And Portland with the ball. Still looking for their first basket since the first quarter. Now, here's Sharp. He's guarded by Harper. Tipped away. Harper with the steal. Here's Jordan. And Mike slam dunk by Jordan. Offensively, defensively, they are in total control. And guys, to go on a big run, get some breathing space. It has to be a great play on each end. Now, here's Grant. Still looking for his first bucket in this one. Harper with the steal. Plays it in off the breakaway. And, and Harper, hard to get around. Physical defender, he'll use that athleticism and reach to pester score. Time called here. The Blazers decide to talk it over. They have been pretty disgusting offensively. Too many miscues. They've got to get to the bottom of it. So the Bulls, their last game, a win against the 76ers. Ball's knocked loose and stolen by Jordan. Shooting foul as the whistle blows. He'll shoot two free throws. Second personal foul. The Bulls have scored six points from their eight attempts at the line so far. line for the Bulls. Ron Harper taking two shots. And that one falls for Harper. He makes one of two that time. Here's Hart. And foul on the shot, so he'll get a chance at the line. Third person. One on Pippen. 
Wow, Second wow, he got five. whacked on that one. Shouldn't be much debate the there. Line for your he made the only game. free throw attempt he Not had earlier in the game. And, and the just a top-notch free break. throw shooter this year. All the way two up shots. there at 88%. That free throw, no good. And he sinks the second. Here's Chicago. They're on a 16 to 1 run. Harper kicks to Jordan. Here's Pippen. And again, no good by Chicago. And so Grant will bring it up for the Portland Trail Blazers. Little passes to Eubanks. Knocked away. Pass to Hart. Jordan with some nice D. Smooth sailing for Chicago. They've only given up one point in the second quarter. That one coming at the line. Now, here's Sharp, guarded by Jordan. Sharp, the pass to Grant. That one drives for him. And get your best scores, high percentage looks, offensive strategy 101. Grant delivering. Good ball movement here by the Bulls. To the wing right side. Kicks it to Pippen. Pass to Jordan. Shot clock at six. And again, Chicago. No good. And it's the Trailblazers with the ball. Pass to Sharp. Now here's Little. The pass to Eubanks. Over Longley. Eubanks, no good. Pass to Jordan. Down low, Harper. And Harper slams it in. Yeah, and this is what happens when you have a score like Jordan on the floor. He attracts all that attention defensively, leaving guys wide open. Pass to Eubanks. Little with the ball. Passes to Sharp. It's Hart on the wing. Guarded by Jordan. Puts it up from 12. They get it back. Shooting foul. As the whistle blows, he'll shoot two free throws. First personal foul. Third. This is his second trip to the free throw line. At the line for Portland. Drew Eubanks, two shots. Shooting two. No good on the free throw. I don't even think he had one free throw before halftime, but he's making up for it here in the second. An almost entirely new group here for Portland. Justice Winslow, he's checked in for Jeremy Grant. Brown comes in for Little. Johnson, he's checked in for Josh Hart. And it's Ty Jerome in for Sharp. Chicago also making some changes. Wennington, he's checked in for Longley. Rodman comes in for Tony Kukoc. And Bushler subbed in for Pippen. Good on the second free throw. And here are the Bulls now. They're on an 18 to four run right now. Back to Jordan. Now here's Harper. Not a lot of room. That drops and it comes off an assist from Jordan. Jordan's got his third assist on the night. Jerome passes to Johnson. And here is Brown. And there's the pass to Eubanks. Pass to Jerome. Five on the clock. Shoots over Harper. 
Trailblazers keep it alive. Here's Eubanks. Portland no good that time either. Solid rebound there, and with the score like it is, that's an area where they can't afford to get lazy. Michael the shot's Jordan. good from Jordan. Assistant and there are nights Ron it really Hunter. doesn't matter what you do defensively. MJ is going to score, and this is looking like one of those nights. Guys, they're looking for a way to score here. Yeah, they've had a tough time taking the lid off. Brown feeling out a bit. And finished off by Brown. Wow. And guys, he's not an easy man to stop when he's got the rim in his sights. Never has been, never will be. He is a determined finisher. Now, here is Jordan. He's got 15. Rodman offline with the baseline jumper. And Portland with the ball. Out left to the wing. Harper with the steal. Pass to Wennington. Jerome with the rebound. He kicks it to Johnson. Passes it to Eubanks. Poked away. And here we go. The Bulls fast break. Jordan's running. Harper's shot is good. Harper. You got to love his hustle. Leaving the defense no time to react. And all of a sudden, that man was just on the other end. Wow. Here's Jerome. There's the pass to Johnson. Winslow against Rodman. Fade away. Rebound by the Bulls. Rodman's got his sixth rebound on the night. Here's Jordan. Two free throws Jordan coming up, foul. and they call the shooting foul. Yeah, Johnson. That's on Keon Johnson. And the defining Second trait of foul. the greatest of superstars, Jordan makes the, the players around him Michael better. Jordan. Mentally, Two in times. terms of effort, and in terms of their performance. Two. No good on that one. The Trailblazers making a switch here. Watford's checked in. Chicago also making some changes. Simpkins comes in for Wennington. And Steve Kerr is subbed in for Ron Harper. And he can't get the second one to drop either. Coming up empty that time. And that free throw percentage has dropped to under 60 now, having a horrible time from the line in this quarter. Winslow shot is off. The way, Greg, they're sharing the ball tonight, mesmerizing. Everyone's getting to touch it, and, and everyone's contributing. Keon and Keon Johnson picks up the foul. foul. That'll be his Third second foul of the foul. game. Yeah, clearly Coming he had an established the position there. Red Brown is checked in for Chicago. Pass to Bushler. Now Kerr. Pass to Bushler. Lock at six. Here's Brown. Sinks that one from the post. Brown. Brown's got eight points. Oh, he is just so tough to guard. He can fake you one way and then use that beautiful spin to just blow by you. They get a hand on it. It's stolen by Brown. Score the basket. His fourth. He's only missed one of his five shots tonight. With reckless abandon, Brown finishes despite the contact. They have to love the heart he plays with. Passes it to Winslow. The pass to Watford. Johnson right side. Down to five on the shot clock. Brown the pass to Watford. From T, Johnson. Chicago grabs the miss. Here's Kerr. The shot's good. Brown Steve making the play. Kerr. Brown's got three assists now in this one. Such a nice 
compact, repeatable motion there. Kerr is a true floor spacer offensively. And taken away by Brown. One on one here. And that'll be two free throws coming up. Officials on the call with the foul. First. Yeah, the defender all over him. Fourth team foul. The Bulls have Shooting made a little Chicago. more than half their free throws Jeff today, Bush 7 Lord. of 12. Taking two shots. Two shots. That free throw, no good. He hits the second from the line. And uh, 101 left to play in the first half. Kerr against Johnson. Pass to Jerome. And no good. The dry spell continuing for him. Left side, Brown. Good on the shot. I'm sorry, that's poor defense down low again. It's been a mismatch thus far in the paint. Jerome passes to Brown. The Trailblazers working the ball around now. Knocks it loose, and it's out of bounds. Uh, they say it was last touch by Brown. Sally, he's checked in for Simpkins. For the Bulls, John Sally. Twenty-six seconds left in the first half. Six on the shot clock. Winslow finds Brown. Again, the miss by the Trailblazers. Boy, you can just see the frustration growing on their faces. Nothing going their way. In a major drought, need to find some sort of momentum. Kerr dishes to Brown. Here's the three. And the last shot at the buzzer doesn't go in for him. Michael Jordan getting it done for the Chicago Bulls. He was a true standout at the offensive end, both with his scoring and his passing. And we'll be right back after this. It's the 2K Sports Halftime Show. Hey, everybody. Good to see you back here on our halftime show. Well, actually, we can't see you, but you can see us, but you get it. Ernie Johnson, Kenny the Jet Smith, Shaquille O'Neal. You're watching the NBA on 2K Sports. Chicago holding the upper hand after the first two quarters. They are completely in control of the game, leading by a massive amount. Kenny, how'd you feel about it? Credit these guys for coming in with the right game plan and then patiently executing. Most of their shots that come in the flow of the offense, rarely did they take a bad shot. Good, clean first half. Looking at Portland, Shaq, your thoughts. I know teams love to rely on the three these days, but you got to know when to get away from it. They didn't, at least throughout the first half. Hopefully they're making the adjustments, but sometimes the teams just get stubborn. That's all for now. Say goodbye to the folks. Thanks goodbye, for folks. joining us. Third quarter, just about ready to begin. Wasn't too much drama in the first half, but maybe things will tighten up here in the second. You look at Michael Jordan in this game, he has been everywhere. No problems fighting his way to the rim in this one. A lot of points in close. And you love that mindset he has going at the rim. He hasn't settled for anything, and he's been the aggressor all game long. And after a very lopsided first half, We'll see if things play out a little more evenly here in the second. So starting the second half, here's who Phil Jackson has on the floor. Dennis Rodman is out there with Pippen. 
Then there's Brown. Then there's Longley. And it's Jordan in at the shooting guard position. Now here's Pippen. Michael Jordan on the wing. Let's go. They get the rebound. The edge yeah, on Rodman. the glass is the difference. It's allowed them to build this lead. Rodman's gone 80% from the field. Four of five shooting. Pass to Jerome. Here's Eubanks. That's tipped. Hart the pass to Eubanks. The Trailblazers need to get off a shot. Jerome, no good. And so it's Pippen with it. He brings it up for Chicago. Brown kicks to Jordan. Little over a minute gone here in the second half. Michael They're doing a really good job of getting the ball inside and attacking the paint. That's an area they have completely dominated. Here's Jerome. Here's Eubanks. Pass to Jerome. Shoots over Brown. And that one goes long. Well, his shooting is unfortunately not helping things. And his lackluster accuracy is probably the thing that's keeping them behind. And it's Rodman, top of the key. And a wide open look for Jordan. Here's Longley. Whistle blows. Bucket is good. And he'll have a chance at the line to make it a three-point play. Well, we've seen that movie a few times, haven't we? An easy bucket in the paint. And this Luke is his first Longley. trip to the line tonight. The and line the Bulls the making a change here. Harper's checked in. One shot. And we're just around two minutes into the final half of play now. They could use a big shot here to get this offense going. Too many empty possessions. Right now, they need a basket. And there's the pass to Sharp. Now, here's Grant. Defended by Rodman. Shot clock at five. Poked loose. Fast break. Here comes Chicago. Here's Jordan. Banked in Michael off the glass. Jordan. And that's 19 Assistant points for Jordan. Dennis Rodman. Yeah, Jordan just glides up the court. It's kind of deceptive. Doesn't look like he's running as fast as he really is. And that was another look at the fantastic Mobile One drive that happened a moment ago. And, and the awareness of his footwork and body on that drive. Wow. Pass to Sharp. Grant outside. Six to shoot. From deep. Again, the miss by the Trailblazers. That's not how you want to come out of the break. Three straight misses. They need to settle in quick. Talk about execution on the offensive end. They're leaving nothing on the table right now. It's caused them to pull away a bit. Let's see if they can keep the train on the tracks. Here is Eubanks. Pass to Sharp. And the whistle blows. It's going to be on Dennis, Dennis Rodman. Rodman. That's first, his first foul. first foul. Richard, last season, a historically foul. close race for the scoring title. And it came down to the wire between LeBron, Joel Embiid, and Giannis Antetokounmpo. It was thrilling those last couple games. It was beautiful. To me, it reminded me of 90s basketball when you had Shaq and you had David Robinson and Patrick Ewing and Hakeem Olajuwon. And now bigger <laughs> players, they're back. Size and strength is still valuable in today's game, and you love to see it. Big Second miscommunication on defense. He recognizes it Shooting and quickly Chicago. takes advantage. Wrong yeah, they're going to do a much better One job shot. of putting a little bit of pressure on him on his way to the hoop. Little. He's checked in for Ty Jerome. And the Bulls making a change here as well. Kukoc has checked in. And that one falls for Harper. 
they've been a little too casual with the ball out there. Yeah, but you can't force that square peg into the round hole. Oftentimes, you just got to make that first simple pass and get a rhythm from that. Here's Eubanks. Here's Sharp. Portland no good that time either. Yeah, and they've shown effort and aggression in the paint, really, right from the tip. Their rebounding edge Daddy right Pepper. now, massive. And Harper brings a lot of physicality to the table. Also solid at cutting the D apart with his passing. And here are the Trailblazers now. After Chicago, picking up a basket just moments ago. To the paint, looking to end the run. And foul on the shot. He'll shoot two at the free throw line. And how about that move by Sharp against the defense, getting them to put contact on him so he can draw the foul. Sharp. And a closer look here shots. at the hustle stance for the Bulls. Two shots. That one is off. And the second free throw, good. And so Jordan will bring it up for the Bulls. In the second half, they've only given up one basket coming from the free throw line. Now here's Pippen. He's got 17. Let's it go from 11. Count it. And he's now 8 of 9 from the floor. Hey, whatever adjustments they made at halftime, they are working to perfection. Oh, yeah, I can't agree more. They haven't missed. Here's Hart. Seven points in the game. They get a hand on it. Harper with the steal. And now here's Pippen with the fast break chance. Running and, and running. They have a big advantage now in those transition opportunities. Here are the Trailblazers with the ball. And while we've got a moment, let's send it over to our terrific reporter, David Aldridge. David? Thanks, guys. Now we see more and more top prospects bypass college or even leave high school early to make six figures playing for G League Ignite. For many years, going pro at such a young age was something we only saw abroad, but that reality is now here. Kevin? I like it too, David. The landscape is shifting, and I think for the better. Thank you for the report. Two coach can't get it to go. Portland with the ball. Here's Hart. Good. Nice job down low. Hart's got his third basket of the night right there. And they get one. Now one of five here in the third. Kukoc passes to Harper. Outside Pippen. In. And his hot hand continues. 10 of 11 from the floor and looking for more. And they're beginning to just flat out fall apart defensively right now, especially on the interior. Hart the pass to Grant. Over Kukoc. Hits the front of the rim and out. Well, the defense didn't have any impact on that shot, but somehow he still misses it. And it's Kukoc so with the Kukoc. jam. And with his height, Kukoc doesn't have a long way to go for the slam. He just pops up there and puts that one down. Passes it to Little. Here's Sharp. Launches a three. Chicago grabs the miss. Kuko just got four rebounds in this game. Upside Pippen. This one for three. And a great assist by Kuko as that one goes in. Yeah, and what you love about Kukoc, the versatility on offense and the terrific court vision. And here's Sharp. Five points in the game. Just five on the clock. Got a piece of it. From deep three-point range, and no good. 
And the Bulls going the other way now. And here we go. The Bulls fast break. Outside Jordan. And he's fouled pretty hard on that shot, but he's got the chance to pick up the points at the line. Personal foul. Clearly a foul. So far in the game, he's 0 of 2 at the line. At the line for the Bulls, Michael Jordan. At the line for two. Shooting two. And the first one drops for the Trailblazers. Watford's checked in, and it's Justin Winslow in for Grant. And Chicago also making a switch. Kerr's checked in. He's off on the second. Each trip down becoming more important. And you need to string some successful offensive possessions together and play tough deep. Maybe they've been going to him a little too much. Now he's having a great game, but his team is losing, and that is all that matters. Here's Jordan. The Trailblazers knocking down the tray. To the middle. Got a piece of it. Rodman, no luck. Now Johnson. Portland moving the ball around. Winslow against Kukoc. And the whistle blows. It's going to be on Dennis Rodman. That's foul number two for him. Some changes for Chicago. Bushler's checked in for Pippen. And it's Brown in for Jordan. Bushler. Randy Brown. Now here's Little. Tight defense on him. The pass to Hart. Five on the clock. Little kicks to Johnson. Shoots from the line. The shot by Watford, no good. I think the defense will live with him taking mid-range jumpers, but maybe just a little bit more resistance. Kerr outside. It's Brown on the wing. Chicago needs to get off a shot here. And the Bulls with another miss. Hard against Brown. And taken away by Brown. Oh, and a fast break for the Bulls. And a lot of contact on that one, so he'll shoot two here. Second personal foul. These are his third and fourth free throw attempts of the game. Shooting for Chicago, Tony Kukoc. Two shots. Oh, take a break. Take a break. Two shots. That's good from Kukoc. coach. And they didn't shoot it very well from the line in the first half, but they've gotten much better since halftime, and it's helped them to secure the lead. The Trailblazers making a switch here. Brown's checked in, and the Bulls making a change here as well. Wennington, he's checked in for Dennis Rodman. Kuko hits them both. Now, here's Hart. 12 points for him. Brown outside. Inside, here's Watford. And he caught that pass in full stride on his way to the big slam. He gives up a bit of size at the center position, but his leaping ability, well, let's just say that makes up for it. Here's Bushler. That's good. And so Kerr with the assist. And you can tell Kerr has a good sense for the floor, which helps him find a ready shooter to deliver the ball to. Now, here's Brown. Johnson outside. Back to Winslow. The dish to Johnson. 
Hart the pass to Watford. Shoots from the baseline, and that one clearly a foul. Gets the whistle, and two shots coming up. First personal foul. Fourth team foul. And he's got his first free throw of the game. Trendon Watford at the line for two. Two shot. And he can't get the first one. Jerome, he's checked in for the Trailblazers. And he sinks the second. Round with it. He's got 12. Remaining in the third. Kicks Two to minutes. Kukoc. Round the pass to Bushler. A minute 50 left in the third. And he gets the whistle. Two free throws coming up. Second personal foul. Fifth team foul. He shot two free throws in the game, the made one and missed Bulls. one. Judd Bushler taking two shots. Oh, take a break. Take a break. Two shots. The first one falls. Luke Longley's checked in for the Bulls. He's perfect from the line this time. There's a minute 47 left here in the third quarter. Johnson outside. Pass to Jerome. Portland moving the ball around. Six on the shot clock. Here's Watford, covered by Long. The shot by Watford, no good. Normally he drains that. Here's Bushler. The shot, no good. Some solid defense from Brown. Here's Jerome. Uses the glass to finish the lane. Jerome's got six. Yeah, the D has not been able to keep the ball out of the paint at that end of the floor. Brown the pass to Bushler. Back to Brown. Pass to Kerr. Round inside, Jerome with the rebound. Three on three. 11 feet away, again the Trailblazers, good for two. And here's Brown, he'll bring it up for the Chicago Bulls. Passes it to Bushler. To the inside. Here's Longley. Another shot. Up again. And it's going to be out of bounds. The Bulls bounds. will retain possession. Bulls ball. And here are the Bulls now. Back to Kukoc. Clock at six. Tries yet again, and the layup is good. Tony Kuko just got six points in the quarter. And haven't we seen that a few times today, guys? I mean, their defense has got to have a little bit more toughness about it. The three quarters of play all in the books, and this one all but over already. It's the Bulls just dominating this one. From Portland, we're back in a moment.
While we have the chance now, folks, let's go to our State Farm assist of the game. And I'm glad this was the pick because I love this pass. Such a great dish. That's what I call court vision. There wasn't a better pass in the game, almost like he had a sixth sense. And one quarter to go in a game that to this point has not been an evenly fought contest. We've got Johnson, and it's Brown in at the three spot. That's the group on the floor for Portland. And oh boy, a lot of contact there, but he gets the call and will shoot two. And for a while there, Greg, it seemed like we were entering the super team era. But lately, homegrown talent, players you draft and develop or sign and develop, seems to be the way teams are going. Yeah, and it's not easy to maintain a culture when you're bringing in stars from outside. We've seen some cautionary examples here of late. Two, two. And that one falls for Johnson. Johnson hits two of them. Here is Kerr. And the pass to Sally. Here's Bushler. Outside, Kukoc. Pass to Bushler. Shot clock at six. And a great assist by Kukoc as that one goes in. Great job of screening there. Nice job to take it to the rim and get the finish. Over in the corner, Brown. Pass to Pell. Here's Blevins. The rebound by Simpkins. Here's Bushler. Fouled on the Portland shot and foul. picks up two points. So Deion one free throw Johnson. coming up. Third. They're taking foul. it right into the teeth of the defense. And, and it's a defense that's starting to look Shooting frustrating. That's the kind of aggression you want to see when you've got a team Shooting on the ropes. One. Richard, I know you've been to Africa. Your mom did a lot of great work there. How gratifying is it to see the investment that the NBA now is making over there? Well, I look at how basketball changed my life and allowed me to accomplish so many great things. And the more One people shot. that have the opportunity to allow basketball to change their lives, you got basketball without borders. You have academies in basketball. You now have the Basketball Africa League. It's great to see these opportunities extended to more people across the globe. That's why basketball is a global game. We're just over a minute into this final quarter of play. Johnson outside. Chicago foul. Jeff Bushler. First personal foul. Second team foul. Here's Lozada. Passes to Johnson. Six on the shot clock. Round with it. Guarded by Sally. Fades. It's hauled in by the Bulls. A little over a minute and a half of the fourth quarter gone now. Here's Bushler. He's guarded by Johnson. And it's denied. Chicago foul. A sensational block that definitely deserves another look. And that has got to help the morale of this team. Let's see if that sets up a run here. 
Harper is yeah, checked in for Kukoc. Ron Harper. Lozada the pass to Blevins. Here's Pell. Johnson outside. Sally against Brown. Lock at six. Knocks it loose. Puts one up from 19. Portland again missing. And here is Harper. Sally passes to Kerr. Fast break. Here come the Trailblazers. Johnson's got the ball. Brown wide open. He fires. Portland again missing. I can absolutely guarantee you that is not the shot they were looking for on that possession. A little over two and a half minutes have passed here in the fourth quarter. Here's Blevins. He's guarded by Harper. Levins passes to Johnson. And some nice ball movement here by the Trailblazers. Just five to shoot. The shot from the low post is good. And the burst of quickness on display with the mobile one drive. And even down big, the effort and energy is still there to try and make a comeback. Kerr the pass to Harper. Here's Sally. He kicks to Kerr. There's the pass to Simpkins. Back to Kerr. Outside Harper. Pass to Sally. Outside Harper. There's the triple. It's hauled in by the Trailblazers. From deep, Johnson. Sally with the rebound. Chicago with the ball. Here in the fourth, they've allowed just four points. And contact Portland on the foul. shot, so he'll be shooting free throws here. Richard, 2004 was the last time that the NBA expanded. Now, some say Seattle and maybe Las Vegas could before long have teams of their own. What do you think? Oh, please give me Seattle back. Please give me Vegas back. Do you know what I would give to have those two cities back in our league and to have to travel to them? Look, but you must Shoot have two. deep pockets. Let's be honest with yourself. The franchises now are selling for over $3 billion. You got to think that the expansion fee will at least be that much per team. First free throw is good. Bulls making a switch here. Wellington's checked in. And that one goes in. Two from the line that time. Fourth quarter of play and over three and a half minutes have gone by. Some tough offensive sets. They want to turn it around. Yeah, right now you just need a bucket to get some momentum. Pass to Lozada. Passes it to Blevins. Shoots over Harper. Blevins can't hit. Kerr against Johnson. Kerr outside. Outside Harper. And it's blocked by Brown. Here's Lozada. Richard, I was wondering, do you think the recent postseason success of small market teams like Milwaukee is good for the NBA? Absolutely. Guys should be able to feel like they can win no matter where they are playing at. And no one wants to see the same couple of teams in the playoffs every single year. Smaller market success makes the league better. Here's Harper. The Blazers getting the bucket. Lennington, the rebound by Pell. And so it's Johnson who brings the ball up for the Trailblazers. They've allowed just seven points here in the fourth quarter. Now, here's Johnson. Now the pass to Pell. 
and they'll get another chance. Chicago foul. Bill winning. Jeffy, he's checked Second in for the Bulls. Foul. Third team foul. Coming out of the floor for the Bulls. Here's Blevins. And the call on the shot that sends him to the line. Third personal foul. Fourth team foul. At the line for Portland. Kelgen. Two shots. He misses the free throw. As you go back and look at the last few seasons, RJ, it, it seems like team success has largely been predicated on health. Do, do you feel like that has always been the case? I don't remember there being as many injuries early in my career, even with guys that were playing all 82 games. But you're right. Recently, we've seen a lot of key injuries. And look, this is my theory. Before, players used to get away from the game a little bit, take a couple of months off. Now players are staying in shape 24-7. Like, they never take a break. And I think that's why we might be seeing players break down a little bit more. Yes or no answer. Too many games at 82 in the regular season should be less than them. Don't you ever ask me that question. Give me 82. I'd rather you bump it to 83 just to remove all doubt. <laughs> it's blocked. And it's going to be out of bounds. The Bulls will retain possession. Bulls ball. Shot clock at three. And the stroke definitely lacking confidence Bill this quarter. Wins. Nothing on target. And they've gotten very aggressive on the offensive glass here in the second half, getting a lot of second chance points. Here's Blevins. Pass to Bell. Trailblazers moving the ball around. Really left alone that time. Johnson's got seven points for the quarter. As a player, a rough first half, look, it can wake you up. Sometimes it leads to much improved play in the second half. Caffey the pass to Harper. Greg, you read about Jimmy Butler starting his own coffee company, and he did that in the NBA bubble, and he drinks, he said, about, about five Bowl cups of coffee a day. Coming Do a lot of NBA players bowls. drink coffee to keep Red them going and get that extra burst? Absolutely. I, I remember drinking coffee on the bench late in my career. Uh, it, it's kind of a comfort food. Warms you up a little bit. and All good things that can get you ready for action, I'm for. Chicago making a switch here. Brown's checked in. And it's in. Basket number six for him thus far. He has only missed two shots from the floor breakdown for the defenders and you can't ask for an easier bucket than that Johnson the pass to Brown now here's Johnson offline with his three pass to Bushley passes it to Wennington shoots over Johnson Wennington no good I tell you what, the defense should send Christmas cards for that miss. Levens passes to Lozada. Here's Pell. The pass to Lozada. And the shot goes down. He used the pick to perfection and got all the way to the rim. So it's Chicago now. Round the pass to Bushler. Here's Caffey to the middle. Here's Simpkins. No good. Some solid defense from Brown. Here's Lozada. They get it back. Levens can't hit. 
not his best efficiency this quarter. Eh, look, sometimes that's how it goes. Johnson with the puck. Guys are looking for a spark here. Yeah, a cold stretch offensively for sure. Round outside. The rebound by Simpkins. Simpkins got his fourth rebound with that last one here tonight. Here's Bushler, covered by Johnson. Here's Wennington. Nice touch on the shot from close range. Wennington's got four this quarter. No settling for an outside shot there. They went right to the hoop. Blevins passes to Lozada. Here's Blevins. Here's Pell. Shoots a fader. And they get it back. And for a lot of up-and-coming teams, getting better defensively is the key to reaching, Greg, that next level. That being considered, what's the first step in that improvement? A lot of times it's bringing in a great defender, like a Pat Beverly or an Andre Iguodala, a defensive anchor who also inspires his teammates to take that challenge. It's good. Assist Normally, Brown's the one Bill doing the providing. Down. Little role reversal there. Pass to Blevins. Now Johnson. Brown outside. Blevins can't hit. Nothing seems to be going his way this quarter. Yeah, straight up, guys. Like, he's ice cold, like freezing. What's colder than cold? But you don't have to shoot it, my guy. It's okay to pass the ball. Here's Bushler. And foul on the shot. He'll shoot two at the free throw line. First personal I'll tell you what, he earned his money on that foul. Team foul. Shooting for Chicago, Dickie Simpkins. Two shots. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. And the first one at the line is good. Justice Winslow, he's checked in for Brown. Both shots good from the stripe. And even with the ratings going strong, the younger generations often cord cut. How does the NBA engage that audience? Kevin, I think making game action trend on social media and when big moments happen for a, maybe a small fee, allow people to be a part of it, it's like highlights, but live. Hell, and that one clearly a foul. Gets the whistle and two shots coming up. First yeah, easy call. Foul. Fifth team foul. At the line for Portland, Norvell Pell taking two shots. Two shots. Relax on the first. That free throw, no good. And he's good on the second. Ooh, you hope that leaving points at the line won't come back to haunt them. Now here's Brown. Here's Simpkins. Back to Brown. And the Bulls get it back. Wennington with the bucket. 
anytime you get a nice look inside, it's a good possession. Johnson outside. 46 seconds left to play in the final quarter. Here's Lozada. Back to Johnson. Shoots. Rebound by the Bulls. Really thought he had this one. And the defense, they were giving it to him. Bushler, the pass to Brown. Here's Wennington. Good ball movement here by the Bulls. And here we go. Trailblazers with a fast break. Pass to Lozada. And he converts the layup. And that's how you lead a team. Literally. Round with it. And so Chicago takes this one, and by a big margin. The the to game. come into an opponent's building and dominate the way they did tonight it says, I think, Greg, an awful lot about this team. I guess they don't need home to support the <laughs> field at home. I mean, Kevin, just a masterful performance all the way around. Thank you for joining us. That'll do it for now. This is Kevin Harlan saying thanks for watching. So long.